In Japan, 300 years ago, there were two secret societies of people who called themselves ninja. One group was called Iga, the other Koga. They were professional spies and assassins, experts in acrobatics, swordsmanship, judo, karate, and hypnotism. The secret school of the ninja had three basic rules. To train your body to endure any hardship. To forget all of your friends and family and to keep your real identity secret. To accept death rather than divulge any of the secrets of the society of ninja. <laughs> Taramaro is dead. Yes, Shintaro fights like a tiger. His sword is like lightning. He's already killed four of us. And what of Kurobe? He promised to kill Shintaro with his powers of sorcery. He has disappeared. What is worse, I have been unable to discover the present whereabouts of Shintaro. Master, it's Kurobe. Kurobe has returned. Kurobe. Make your report. Ryushido, I have failed you. First Taramaro's death, and now this. I am displeased. Yes. But I beg of you, O oh Master, to give your humble servant one more chance. Many years ago, when the legions of the great general Taira revolted, there lived a master swordsman named Saburo Kaneye, who became lord of Koga. This man learned the secrets of ninjutsu and founded the Society of Koga Ninja. Yes, here I am, a descendant of Koga, with all the men that I can use, yet none of you can cross swords with Shintaro. You're a pack of sniveling dogs. I swear that I will kill him. Where is Shintaro now? In the Shimo Torizawa region, near Otsuki. You're wrong. What? We have many men searching east and west. He has completely vanished. Do you understand? Our clever Shintaro is not there. But for some reason, he wants us to think that he is. Krobe, find Shintaro. You must discover his plans. Yes, I obey. causes the terror I see burning in Kurobe's eyes. Gyobu. Kasumi Gyobu, I want you to follow Kurobe. Yes. Somebody be following me. Ah, I'm just nervous. And with good reason. Our master is a man to fear. Those eyes of his make my blood turn to ice. Ah, this is no good. 
A ninja should have no fear. Am I getting soft? I'm sorry, Shusaku. Oh, don't worry about me. I'm all right. But I hope your eyes will heal soon. This medicine is supposed to work quickly. Kurobe made it for you. Can you see now at all? I can barely make you out, Shusaku. You won't be able to fight the ninjas like that. I know. Kurobe told me about a secret medicine flower. I'll go pick some for you right now. All right. Is that you, Kurobe? Yes, I have just returned. Shintaro, how are your eyes? The hot spring water has helped me considerably, and I feel much better. I'm glad of that. How can you help but hate me? You know that all that's happened to you has been my fault. I met a famous ninja in battle. I fought and beat him. My eyes were closed. But I saw him with my spirit. Kurobe, I should thank you. You are too kind. By the way, Shintaro, I went to the Koga Fort to do some spying. I think they suspect that something serious has befallen you. Kurobe, you must be very careful. A ninja who turns traitor is courting certain death. Nah, do not trouble yourself. Where is Shusaku? He went to pick the medicine flowers you told him about. What? Boy, what are you doing there? Just what it looks like. I'm picking flowers. That's nice. I wonder if you know the meaning of those flowers. Of course. Shikarigusa, the luminous flower that makes blind men see again. Leave me alone. I'm picking them because they're pretty. Well then, perhaps I should help you pick the rest. Go away. You found them. I think that these should be enough for now. Are they truly that good? Of course they are. Pretty. Why, even as a child, I have always loved these beautiful flowers. Kurobe, I've never heard a ninja talk like that before. <laughs> That's true enough, but I've left the ninja for good. Shusaku, when Shintaro's eyes have healed, how would it be if I guided you and took you to your father's house? Will you? Good. I'll pick all the flowers you need. No, no, no. One of the Koga men might see you. You had better stay in the hut for a few days. Hmm? Shusaku, did you see anyone outside today? Hmm. I just met an old farmer, but he didn't look funny at all to me. This old farmer. What did he say? 
He knew those flowers are shikarigusa. What? That's not good. Kurobe, do you think he was a ninja? Yes. Only the Koga Society know of those flowers, so he must be one of them. Kurobe was right about this. Who are you? Kyobu. Kurobe, you have betrayed us. No. Stop lying. You know very well the penalty a ninja pays for turning traitor. Now. Where is Shintaro? Where is he? I don't know. Oh, now I know. Your friend cannot see, can he? That's why you wanted flowers. Well, now. So Shintaro is blind. What are you doing? You should know. I'm making it impossible for you to escape. I'll take care of you after I finish off your blind friend. Shintaro! Shut up! <gasps> Shusaku, did you hear something? Help me! Come here and help me! Please help! Ah, it's Kurobe's voice. I'm badly hurt. Please help me. Shusaku, go help him. Yes. Kurobe! Where are you? Over here. I'm in trouble! Where are you? Over here! Ah! Shintaro. Kurobe. Are you hurt? Still cannot see? Hmm. But where is Shusaku? I lost the medicine flowers, so I sent him for more. Let me see your eyes. Hmm. Please. How you die. <laughs> that voice is... I am a Koga ninja. Kasumi Gyobu. What? And Kurobe. Come here, up here. What happened to you, Kurobe? Who did it? Who tied you up? Shusaku, Shintaro is in danger from a ninja who practices Kasumi Watari magic. What? From a ninja?
my magic, Kasumi Watari. Shintaro, you won! Kurobe, the sword fight with this ninja has taught me the technique of blind fighting. Oh? I will call this new technique Mumyoken. You are the master of the sword. Brilliant! Wonderful! <coughs> Kurobe, what's wrong? Kurobe! Kurobe! I I'm finished! An arrow! Shuzaku! Every ninja must die a ninja. He who breaks our law dies. Kurobe, this is our law. You must die. Ryushiro. Are you a Koga ninja? I am their leader. Someday I will kill you, Shintaro. Krobe. Krobe. Krobe, are you all right? Krobe. <laughs> Shintaro, you are marked for death. <laughs> I am very happy. Now Shintaro has the gift of sight once more. Yes, 
I can hardly admit this, but I never realized before how very beautiful Mount Fuji is. You mean this is the first time you've seen Mount Fuji? <laughs> no, no. I've seen it many times. Kurobe, you were a ninja before. And being a ninja, you could never see the pure beauty of nature. Hmm. Was I blind to what others see? Hmm. The true spirit of human life is to love your fellow man, help him, trust him, try to build a peaceful world. Most men believe in these things. However, the ninja and their societies have twisted ideals, wickedness. They dedicate their lives to one goal, sowing the seeds of hate and fear in the world. Ninja are the tools of very wicked people. They can never find peace. Shintaro. I am very grateful to be here with you amidst all this natural beauty. I feel that I am reborn again into a better world. Where'd you find it? What's wrong? This is secret writing only ninjas use. Secret writing? Yes. This secret writing consists of certain things. The elements. Fire, wood, stone, water, gold, silver, lead, marble, and also colors. Blue, green, red, and white, purple and black, and other combinations. What is written here reads, this is the road to death. Road to death? And if we take this road, the three of us will die if that's their message. Since leaving Edo, you have killed five members of the Koga Society. They want revenge. They will use sorcery to kill you. I must discover their plan. Then we won't take this road. Kurobe, lead us. Yes, this way. <laughs> <laughs> 